Welcome to my new series about hybrid fractals. After learning about hybrid fractals, and realizing it was not practical to manually program all of them, because there is an unlimited number of them after all, I wrote something that would allow me to compose various fractals during runtime. However, I still have to choose the base function beforehand. Now the simplest solution would have been to select 10, but that just wasn't enough. Having 16 would have been possible, but only practical if I used hexadecimal notation. So I decided on using 20 instead. First test showed some unexpected results, and I realized that that had to do with the initialization. So I now have the option to choose between two starting conditions. I also had to limit the number of functions to iterate between, and settled for four. That means I can now generate 320,000 hybrid fractals, although many are duplicates. And while I would love to, it is obviously impractical for me to show you all of them. Of course I could use a random number generator, but it is more fun to let my viewers decide. So for this series I'll have you pick a number between 0 and 320,000 in the comments, and I would appreciate it if you would specify a color scheme and method. I'll then take those votes and make videos about the selected fractals, probably a short zoom. Oh and there will be a part 2 of this video where I will show the 20 functions I selected in more detail. Now then, go to the comments section and vote for your lucky number. Or watch the companion video and calculate the code of your dream fractal. Thank you for watching to the end. If you enjoyed it, I would appreciate if you were to like and share this video, and don't forget to subscribe if you don't want to miss my next video.